six foot four Balenciaga all black. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Alexis. Today I will be sharing with you what to buy from the Spring Sephora VIB sale. I will also be sharing with you today my recommendations and my personal wish list as to the things that I want to pick up this sale. So without further ado, let's get started. If you have not already, please subscribe to my channel. So let's just point out the obvious here, like my hair looks completely different. I know, I'm still trying to get used to it. You guys, tell me what you think about it. <laughs> let's get on into my recommendations first and then later we'll jump right into my wish list. So first things first, I feel like this is a must and that every sale, I love to just pick me up another one of these because I just love them and it just works. It is the Urban Decay D Slick Setting Spray. I absolutely love the setting spray. It's the only setting spray I use. I will try other setting sprays, but always come back to this one because this one is so good to the face. It's not heavy at all. It just sets your makeup so well. It's oil free, and I just think that on the skin, it just helps your skin just pop after you spray it. So that's why I love this, and every sale, I make sure to pick up one of these. Next product that I want to share with you is foundation. Now, I only have one foundation that I'm going to be sharing today. That's because this foundation is so, so good that I feel like every girl new to makeup that have been in makeup should definitely have this in their collection or or it's something that they use on a daily. It is the Fenty Beauty, what is it, the Hydrating Long Wear Foundation. Um, this is from the Pro Filter line. Rihanna has two foundations. This is the more of the hydrating one. She does also have a, a more matte one. I love this one because I feel like no matter what skin type you are, this one goes really, really well with your skin. It just lays on the skin so perfectly. It's super light, but it's also covering as well. So it just makes your skin look very, very good. I actually have a review on this one. I'll definitely link this down below for you to check out. I'm the shade 445 in this. How dirty it is. It's because I use it so much. I barely have any left, but I'm going to keep pumping this thing until it pumps out because it is so good. <sighs> Next, I want to mention to you is concealer, of course, foundation and concealer. This concealer is one concealer that if I had to pick out a concealer out of all my concealers, I would definitely pick this one because this one is for everyone. This concealer is not too heavy, not too light where it doesn't have coverage. It's just like the perfect concealer. It is said to be a um, long wear concealer, which I feel like it is because I feel like when I wear this concealer, it's that one concealer that I don't have to worry about creasing up under my eyes, just making my eyes look dry. It just it makes the under eyes look so so good no matter what type of issues you may have depending on what shades you get it just makes everything look very very good and it's like one of my top concealers i mean it is my top concealer because when i travel when i go anywhere this is the first thing i pick up even if i grab other concealers i'm definitely picking up this one because it is so 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 good now this one's a little bit deeper so sometimes i use this to like kind of like fake contour um but I have the lighter shades like 5N, um, which is like my under eye shade. And I just love the way it looks under my eye. Next product I want to mention is a bronzer. This bronzer is my favorite bronzer that I feel like on this sale you have to pick up. It is the Fenty Beauty Bronzer. If you are someone of my skin tone and you have been looking, searching high and low for a bronzer, I feel like that this bronzer fits multiple skin tones very well. I mean, she has different shades, but this one, the Mocha Mommy, fits multiple skin shades um, in my range. I love it, love it, love it. Mine is currently cracked, <laughs> but that's how much I love it because even though it's cracked, I'm still using it every single day, just dipping my brush in and then dashing it off and then going right back to what I was doing with applying this to my face. It is so, so good. It has like a reddish brownish tone, which I feel like feel, fits really well with my skin tone. And maybe that's why I love it so much, but I definitely feel like there's not enough bronzers out there for deep skin. And if you're looking for a good bronzer, this is one that you should try. Now I know that she just came out with some cream ones. Just to give you a little heads up, that's actually something that's on my wish list to get. <laughs> I think that it possibly might be something that you could top with this, the cream and then the powder, and then your makeup just look flawless and like on point. So I definitely recommend you guys pick this up during the sale. 
Next thing I want to mention to you is Charlotte Tilbury. Um, this is a blush. I have been so much into blushes. I actually have a little dab of this on today. I can actually show you this one because it's so beautiful. I feel like for my skin tone or even lighter that this is just perfect. Like it's just like it's a dash of pink. It's not too pinky. It's not too dark like as if it was a bronzer, but it could be used as one. It's just like it's just like really, really perfect. And I just think that um, the shade, it just gives you like a hint of color onto your skin. I love to add it after I add my bronzer and I just feel like it sets my makeup off to the point where I'm just like in love because it just, it just, it just completes it, honestly. It really does complete my whole look, in my opinion. Next I wanna to mention to you is this setting powder. I have been completely obsessed with this loose setting powder from Anastasia Beverly Hills. Definitely something that you should pick up on the sale. One, look at this container. This container is gonna last you to the next sale or even after that, which is something that I like. I love products that last a long time. I use this every single day, sometimes twice a day, if I like take off my makeup and put it on again. And I have still yet to break the container, like even get to half of the container with this because you only need so little of it and it spreads all around your face. I mean, our faces are not that big. So just think with this little container, it's like half of like my face. It's going to last a long time. Now I have the shade Deep Peach. I feel like for my skin tone, it is just perfect. Like it blends right onto my skin. It doesn't leave any ash. It doesn't leave any flashback. It doesn't leave any of that. It And it's not super drying as well because I know some powders are very drying to the skin. This one is just so perfect on the skin and makes your skin look great. So if you're looking for a different setting powder or looking for a really, really good setting powder that lasts all day, I definitely recommend you pick up this one because this one is bomb, okay? Let me show it to you really quickly so you can see the shade. So you see how it's like not too yellow. It's actually like a deep peach. It's like the perfect shade for someone that of my skin tone. Now these do come in multiple shades. So definitely try to find your shade within it and Girl, you're going to be all set. I'm telling you, all set. <laughs> Next, I want to jump into skincare. So the first thing that I want to mention to you on skincare is this cleansing gel. This is a soap-free formula, and it is just amazing on the skin. I recommend this gel to everyone that is looking to heal their skin. I know that some people get intimidated over the price because this is like one of those things where it is a little bit pricey for skincare, but it's so worth it. Like, I rarely have bumps. The only time I have bumps nowadays is when I'm going through my cycle, and that's it. This gel cleans my face so well, and it doesn't dry me out, and that's why I love it. Continue to use it morning and night when I wash my face because it is thebomb.com. Like, you use it and thank me later. Like, that's all I have to say. Whatever face wash you've been using, drop it, stop it, and grab this one because you will not regret this on your skin. I used to break out a lot right down here. Not anymore since I started using this gel. So I definitely recommend you guys picking this up. Even if you get a tester of it, try it out on your skin and let me know what you think. Next product I want to mention to you is this toner that I have been obsessed with. And it is the Wonder Beauty Miss Connection Essence and Toner. This looks like milk, but once it settles, it like separates and it's like a pinkish. It's honestly a lightweight mist. I can probably go ahead and spray it right now. It's like so light, you could spray it anytime. You can almost use this, I feel like, as a setting spray. I feel like if I was outside on a hot day, I would just spray this and it would just like make me feel just rejuvenated. So I definitely recommend you picking this up because it is worth the money, especially because it's a toner. It's an essence and a toner, so it's almost like a refresher and it's something that's actually helping your skin. So I definitely like think that this is worth the buy. Next I want to mention to you is this sunscreen. If you are not wearing sunscreen, what are you doing? Because every one of us, no matter what skin tone we are, what shade we are, what background we are, we should be wearing sunscreen. Sunscreen is so, so important for your skin. I wear sunscreen every single day. I apply it in the morning. I do it with my morning skincare routine because it's so, so important to be wearing this. I particularly like this one by Supergoo. Supergoo has so many sunscreens. It's like kind of almost like which one do you like for your skin <laughs> because they have like a roll on, they have a spray, they have a gel, like it's so much. 
I have been loving this one. It's SPF 40 and it's water resistant as well. The reason why I am obsessed with just the brand of Supercoop because it doesn't leave a white cast. Somebody of my skin tone, I cannot have a white cast showing up on my face after I've applied it. So this is like a clear yellowish gel. Um, it goes on clear, but I think it's like yellowish. It's like the same color as this top. It just doesn't weigh down the skin. It doesn't make my skin feel oily. It's just literally there protecting my skin. I love it. Back in the day, I used to have bad sunspots, and it was because I wasn't using sunscreen. And if you have sunspots or if you never had sunspots and you don't know what they are, you don't want them because mine was right here. And that's what it really got me serious and into using sunscreens because I was like, oh, I don't need to use that. Yes, you do, because guess what? Those sunspots look ugly and they take forever to go away. They just literally look like a black spot on your face. So uh, if you don't want sunspots, definitely use a sunscreen every single day. Now, the next product on my recommendation list is the fragrance that I have. It's actually a new fragrance. It is the Black Tulip by Nest Fragrances. I actually received this as a gift and I swear to you, like this fragrance lasts all day. Not fragrances cost a lot. Then like an hour later, you can't even smell them. This is one that lasts all day on the skin. I'm actually gonna spray a little bit. Mm. Yes, like it's like a floral, but then it almost has like a little bit of musk in it. Like it's like the perfect scent. If you were looking for something that, a little bit of floral, a little bit of musk, and like just a little bit of greatness, this is it. I feel like during this time, this is the perfect time to pick up those fragrances because, you know, fragrances can get super expensive. So if you were trying to figure out like, what should you buy on the sale, skincare and perfumes are like what I go to first, like when I'm searching for the things that I'm going to buy because they're super expensive and you can get a good discount on them. This fragrance smells so good and I definitely recommend you guys picking it up. I wish you guys could smell it through the camera. <laughs> <laughs> now let's move on to my wish list because I do have a wish list that I am putting together. I'm going to share with you some of the things on my wish list. So one thing that's on my wish list right now is the Tatcha Liquid Silk Canvas Featherweight Protective Primer. This primer is about $52, but it has really good reviews and I've been hearing people talk about it. So I was like, you know what? There's a sale. Why not try it out? You know, now and see what it's all about. It says it's supposed to be a weightless oil free liquid primer that protects your skin from pollens and makeup while helping your look go on better and last longer. It is for normal dry combination and oily skin. Uh, if you have skin concerns of pores, redness, and dullness, and uneven texture, this is for you. It's supposed to feel like a thin layer of silk. It's supposed to diminish the looks of pores, fine lines, and imperfections. So, I know Tatcha is a really well known brand. They're a really expensive brand, so I think that um, I might try this out. I've always wanted to try some of their products, and I was like, you know, let me try this first and see if I like the brand. Um, if I could go into the store right now, I'd probably like get a tester of this, but since that's not even an option with all this quarantine stuff going around, I was like, what the heck? Let me just buy it and see what it's about. If I don't like it, then I'll return it. Next product I have been looking into is the Inky List. I've never heard of this brand before. Um, I think it's a new brand to Sephora, but it's under the Clean at Sephora. And so that's another reason why I wanted to try it. It is a transanic acid hyperpigmentation treatment. I've been looking for things to help me with my hyperpigmentation because I do have that. And I just, you know, want to have really all around good skin. So I'm looking for anything and everything that can help me solve that issue because I feel like that's the only issue that I have with my skin is the hyperpigmentation. So I've been looking for things to help me clear that. This one is an overnight treatment that helps target the appearance of hyperpigmentation and dark spots for more even skin tone. It is for normal dry combination of oily skin. Uh, if you have skin care concerns of hyperpigmentation, dark spots, indulgence, and uneven texture, this is for you. It, it shows all the ingredients in it, which is transexamic acid, acai berry extract, and the vitamin C derivative uh, in it. So, uh, I don't know. I want to try that out. And that's only like $15. It's 197 reviews, and most of them are really good. So, I'm like, mm, why not? The next product I have been looking into is is the Fenty Beauty Cheeks Out of Freestyle Cream Bronzer. I'm really interested in seeing how this product is just because I have the powder bronzer and like I was telling you before, I think that possibly these might pair together really, really well. That's why I'm gonna pick up the shade Chocolate because I think that it will go well with my skin. Um, it's supposed to be a non 
greasy cream bronzer or like a soft contour so I think like if I wanted to go like very intense I would use the powder and the, the cream but for what it's saying I probably can just use the cream some days by itself to give me like a light look you know so mm, I'm definitely interested in trying that and that's why those things are in my wish list the last thing that's in my wish list that is like been out of stock for like ever um, and I'm actually trying to wait on it to get back in stock before I make my purchase. It is the Shado Wasso Eye Opening Essence. It is a very well talked about eye cream that like it literally not does not have one bad review and that's why i'm like really going crazy because i have been looking for an eye cream to help me with my puffiness and my dark circles and this one has really really good reviews but like everywhere it's sold out so i signed up to get a notification as soon as it arrives back i don't know if it's going to arrive back during the sale but I'm trying to wait a couple days and if it doesn't by the last day of this sale i'm just going to go ahead and make my purchase and then once it does come back into stock i am going to purchase it but i wanted to read to you a little bit about it it is supposed to help you with dark circles and puffiness it is a lightweight gel which means it probably goes really really well under your makeup it is a skin brightening complex with vitamin c and it boosts your skin natural radiance and it gives you clarity boosting complex with vitamin e which promotes blood circulation to improve dullness and prevent pigmentation this product is definitely something that i'm eager to try um it's only 28 dollars, but it's like very very small i'm gonna wait for it to get back in stock but regardless the other three things that i share with you are going to be like they're on my wish list and they're things that i want to purchase from sephora at this point so yeah that's pretty much it for me that, that is everything that i had to recommend to you also that's everything that is on my wish list at this time i hope you guys really enjoyed this video and i hope that it was helpful to you if you have any questions comments or concerns don't hesitate to leave them down below let me know what you guys have purchased or plan on purchasing from the Sephora B.I.B. Spring Sale. Let me know. Let's see if I need to add some things to my list. But until next time, guys, I will see you later. Bye. Don't forget to subscribe on your way out.